Bruce Isaac. Oh, please don't kill me. I swear I'll have... Wait, you... You don't work for Mr. Bishop, do you? I don't. What makes you think that? Sorry, it's just... You look like his type, you know? You got that hard-ass wasteland explorer thing going on. Why would this Mr. Bishop be after you? Oh, well, that's all just a big misunderstanding, see? Mr. Bishop, well, he owed me a lot of money, and, uh, you know, he's a busy guy, so I sort of figured I'd just take it off his hands. Oh, dear. You robbed a casino boss. Robbed is such an ugly word. It's more like I took care of a payroll problem for him. Also, I might have uh, sort of plowed his daughter. A little. Oh, dear. You really don't know when to quit, do you? I guess I don't. That's why I'm here. Uh, I'll let you know if I find any work for a singer. All right. You do that? Great. I really appreciate. I don't know that. when he told me he was a singer. Aren't you? Well, aren't you the singer from New Reno? I think I, I think I saw you play the clubs there. Oh, so you have heard of me? Yeah, that's right. Uh, I was the big draw at the Shark Club. People used to pay hundreds of caps to see me. Cool. So why did you come all the way out here from New Reno? Because Mr. Bishop was after him. You don't know Mr. Bishop. He's not like other bosses up there. He knows the wasteland like the back of his hand, and he likes to wander it. I knew if I didn't get way the hell away from New Reno, he'd run me down like a dog. Right. Uh, yeah, yeah. See you later. Okay, so I can't call these guys. Okay, so maybe it's not a... Ooh, maybe it's Jeannie Mae Crawford, but I just need to find some evidence. Kaya's key. Oh, that might be the room we stay in. When we rent. No. Okay. Alright. So. We don't have any concrete evidence. Which worries me. Um, grab those. Um, is there anything in here? Okay. I was wondering maybe there was some message about things. I don't want to steal. Because there definitely won't be anything. Having just taken all of the stuff in this. I'm, I'm, at, <coughs> I'm about to sneeze. Oh, I was saying. Uh, ooh. Is there anything useful in here? Uh, bill of sale. I don't know about this other stuff. Actually, I may as well, while I'm in here, I may as well take those. Also, caps would not be... Uh, Discernible. We, the representatives of the Consul of Officiorum, well, Officiorum, have this day bargained and purchased from Jeannie May Crawford of the Township of Novak the exclusive rights to ownership and sale of the slave Carla Boone for the sum of 1,000 caps and those of her unborn child for the sum. So she must have known she was pregnant. We covenant with the said Jeannie Mae Crawford that we have full power to bargain and sell said slave and her offspring. Payment of an additional 500 caps will be due pending successful maturation of the fetus. The claim to which shall be guaranteed by possession of this document. M. Scribonius Libo Drusus et al. Administrators of M. Licinius Crassus, Consul of Officiorum Ab Famulatus. It's the person you can't ask to begin with. Right. <clears throat> now we have hard evidence. Where be ye? Hey there. Hello. Is everything all right? Awful late to be dropping in unexpected. Uh oh. <laughs> Okay, so I can't, like, challenge her on that. What well, can you tell me up, Boone's wife? How should I put... Yeah. She never did take... It's the same thing. I got the feeling... That's why he's so bothered about it. 
because he also knew she was pregnant. Come with me, there's something you should see in front of the dinosaur. Okay, if that's what you think. Walk slowly back. Well, walk. And then, yeah, she walks faster than... Hey, NPCs who do this. Either have them run at the same rate as me, or walk the same rate as me. This kind of in-between is always annoying. Still up there. Uh, apparel. Oh, I, I, I left too early. What the quest? What the quest? One for my baby. Oh, that's. That is a sad double meaning, isn't it? Okay, no armor, but plus one perception, which is what these give as well. I think that looks better anyway. Oh, that's horribly sad. Actually, does she have a key to a room? Oh. <laughs> the safe key, anyway. Already have the safe key. Oh, glasses. Can you have glasses and headgear? And, um, they don't do anything. But No, this is important. This is important now. Reading glasses. Can I wear those as well? <gasps> I can wear reading glasses as well. Ha ha. <laughs> I'm going to wear these now. I have a trophy. <laughs> Howdy, partner. Yeah, I'm just going to be sad with Boone for a little bit. That's it, then. How did you know? Just a hunch. I just wanted you to kill her. Her story didn't add up. I mean, no one really has a story. Um, I don't think. But I found the bill of sale. I guess I shouldn't be surprised. It'd be like them to keep paperwork. Here. This is all I can give. I think our dealings are done here. What will you do after this? I don't know. I won't be staying, I know that. Don't see much point in anything right now, except hunting legionaries. Maybe I'll wander. Like you. Oh, you could come with me. Let's go after the legion. You don't want to do that. I thought snipers worked in teams. <laughs> yeah. Working on your own, you're a lot less effective. I've been there and paid for it. But this isn't going to end well. Fine. Let's get out of here. <gasps> Wait. Oh. I was like, I got really excited because I was like, in Fallout 3 you could only have one companion. But then I realized you could have a companion and dog meat. So, is is a robot friend? M Mr. Reddy? Is he? Is he? Oh, that always gets me. Is he, is he a spare? Okay, so now we have another... Oh, flip. This means we're not going to be as friendly with the, uh, with the Legion, are we? That's the wrong button. Okay, but this is going to make things easier for fighting. Right, what do you have? No, use melee. No, that's stupid. Open inventory. Fine by me. First week on beret. Oh, I've got one. <gasps> we can be a team. <laughs> Sunglasses. And um, Merc Grunt outfit, which I don't think looks very nice. Do I have better armor that I could give him? Oh, yeah, apparel. Legion Recruit, yeah, he's not going to be happy with that. No, he's probably going to stick with those. That's got no damage, but it gives extra perception and extra crit chance. That might be... Oh, I've got the armored Vault 13 jumpsuit, which is... 
the equivalent. Of the so let's give you that, because you might switch to it. Yeah. And then I will switch to the Armored Vault 13 jumpsuit. And I'll put on the beret. I look a bit more ragtaggy. <laughs> right, okay. So we've done a couple of quests here. That's quite fun. I like that. So we need to go and head to Repcon before Manny tells us about the Khans. And we need to head up to the Crimson Caravan area, which is all the way up there, which is where we're probably going to be heading anyway. Oh, Repcon! I thought Repcon... No, Repcon... Repcon facility west of Novak. Okay, so it's that Repcon, not that one. So we're not going to be heading to the 188 trading post yet. Um, we're going to want to head there. We're going to want to head to the test site first. So that's fine. So we have a friend, and we're all long-range people. This is this is going to go well. I think we, I think Fallout 3 we worked quite well, having um, Paladin Cross, who was more of a um, uh, up close person while I was more long range. Whereas I think we're all kind of pretty long range here. So this could go badly. Ponomi's thinking maybe we should go and deal with, go and visit Nelson. Um, wow. Normally they move when you kick them, but this one, this one's actually, this one actually can take my weight. That's impressive. Um,. Considering that this place has now basically lost a sniper, I'm wondering if going to Nelson makes a bit more sense. Like, I don't think... I, to be fair, I don't think the game is going to be sufficiently advanced that this town is going to be taken over by the Legion because there isn't a sniper 12 hours of the day. But, um... I don't know. Roleplay-wise, they do seem like they're the bigger threat. Um, hmm. I don't know. Hmm, I think, no, I think we go to Repcon. I think head towards Repcon is probably the more sensible thing to do, because maybe we'll then have to go to Nelson. Manny will then be like, oh, no, actually, you should go to Nelson. And then we've got Helios, Helios 1, something to do with the sun. Um, so yes, that's probably a silo looking at it. Yeah, Helo Swan, and then we'll probably end up getting sent up here, I would guess. I don't know, but yeah, I think, no, I think, I think actually go to Repcon is probably the, the sensible thing to do. Although part of me wants to... Part of me does want to go to Nelson. I wonder what the guy will say now that I've got another NCR dude. Will that have changed his mind? Because he might still be like... Rah, 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 rah. Basically. Um, so he might still be a bit kind of... If you go down there, I'm going to assume you're friends with, the, with them... Because they'll, because or you're dead. So if you come back alive, you're on their side. Um, if he hasn't changed his tones, then we're definitely going to do rep, um, repcon. Um, if he has changed his mind, I will have to actually think about things. <gasps> Thinking about what I'm going to do. The horror. The horror. We're getting close to Nelson. Any closer, I'm shooting any legionary I see. Hope that's not a problem. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm thinking. Uh, we'll keep our distance. Uh, that's not a problem, that's a solution. <laughs> to be fair... Damn right. You and I, we're just a couple of problem solvers. Yep. So I'm gonna have a chat with these guys. Howdy. What's the word? 
Uh, anything I can do to help? Maybe. I'd like to know who I'm dealing with first. Okay, I should be going now. Hey, hold on. Uh, yeah, you're gonna die, or yeah. Okay, understood. Okay, so he doesn't recognize us. Maybe we need to improve our reputation with the NCR then. I mean, can't I be like, look, look, here is famed NCR sniper Boone. I'm I'm fairly sure he has a first name, but I can't. But he's either not told me what it is yet, or I can't remember what it is. This is going well, but um, <laughs> um. Okay, so maybe we need to boost our reputation with the NCR, so that then he would remember. He wouldn't be like, "Oh, I've heard about you. You've done a lot of pos a lot of good work for the NCR." Um. Yeah. It's probably more along the lines that he's then sure that we could take them, because if he thinks we're going to die unless we're friends, that's a problem. So yeah, we're going to have to deal with Repcon then and head to the test center before coming back and chatting with Manny, who's going to tell us about um, the man in check. Is Manny up there now? I assume so. I can't actually see. Never mind. Um... So yeah, I think we've... Oh, this is quite interesting. We had a little um, investigation. I would have preferred it if if it were more a case of you go around and you hear different people. Like, they didn't know that, that she'd gone missing. Um, I mean, he didn't like it. Like, she didn't really say anything that made her suspicious. It was just the fact that of these people, she was the only one I couldn't send. I couldn't seem to send. Maybe, did I not scroll? Maybe I didn't scroll down far enough. <laughs> Maybe my hunch is based on pure error. That's entirely possible. <laughs> Alright, so yes, we're going to be heading up into... Is it through here? Wait, is that where the Nightkin came from? Oh, dear. That's going to make things really, really weird. Invisible super mutants. Invisible super mutants. Invisible super mutants. Oh, that's that's terrifying. No, thank you. No, thank you at all. Um. Did he? He must. Yeah, he was heading back this way, so he must have come down from this way. Oh, and here's a dead ghoul. So yeah, there's. Oh, yeah, these guys are irradiated, aren't they? Okay, you don't have anything. Right, yeah. Okay, oh, great. We've got we've got radiation and potentially invisible super mutants. What level am I? What level am I? I'm level five. Invisible super mutants. Good grief. But that'll be next time. And I'll try and put, like, and I'll try and put it off. <laughs> Invisible super mutants. Uh, I mean, to be fair, not that invisible. You could make out the wibbly lines around him. But yes, up to Repcon, dealing with the ghouls. That will be next time. Thanks for watching, everyone. Thanks for watching.